we go then. Hello guys, welcome back to Second Fashions. Today we're looking at Winth Poo. Growing up and working together from Nice Night 8. Um, interesting release this is. I think it's the only Disney video of that sort of distribution range I've only owned, really, in this collection. Um, interesting. And it's about the Weird Boom. An all time favourite character that for many people love, including myself, actually. Um, the 77 film, the anthology film, is actually one of, this, one of my favourite Disney films of all time. In top five, it is. So it's pretty excellent. Excuse me. So, yeah, this video just released is actually to do with. Um, the All New Adventures of Winnie the Pooh, which was broadcast between 1988 and 1991. Um, it's quite interesting because Jim Cummins is the voice of Winnie the Pooh, obviously has been for many, uh, for many years, I think since then, uh, since then actually. Although I think, it's, I think it's the first time he's actually done it, voicing uh, Winnie the Pooh and maybe Tigger as well in the series. But it's an interesting one. It's um, very of its time really, you know, in terms of his music, which is great actually, but it's very 80s of course, it's very Maybe of its time it is. But the animation is good actually. Voice acting is great and got pretty decent stories. There's only two actually, so they're quite feature length they are, but let's get into them. So, first of all, got, first of all we've got is growing up. Sends around Christopher Robin very much. Um, going to a friend's or some girl's birthday party and they think, obviously, Pooh and friends believe that he's growing old and they think, let's make him more gentleman, more grown up like. Involved just in himself in a three, three, uh, three piece suit and a top hat. Uh, sure enough, manners to be more independent and stuff, you know, and stuff like that, really. You know, and basically just, excuse me, just grooming him, I think, and, well, not really grooming him, but sort of, well, maybe, just like in teaching him to actually become more, more of an adult, an adult really, to be honest. Uh, pretty interesting, actually, pretty good. Um, interesting. Interesting. It's an interesting thing about you know, like I think they might lose because probably if he goes if he goes this Charles birthday, this girl's birthday party, very much and you know I think you know he's got all he's he's got he's going he's going up and of course you know mean of people of course so yeah it's an interesting one really. Um, then we've got uh, the last one, which is working together. There's only, of course, there's only two growing up and working together. Working together is actually a pretty interesting one because it focuses on Golfer, um, the character of Golfer, actually. More prominent in this episode, really. Um, Golfer, he, to be honest, I didn't. Hmm, I wasn't aware of him. Like, he's not very really a sort of familiar character to all, for, you know, for um, the way many of the people, the entire series, actually. I think he was in the books he was. He was in the original film as well, the 77 movie, this TV show. And maybe some subsequent director video movies as well, but he hasn't, he's very sort of underrated. Like, you can't forget, like, he's there really. You know, you focus on the other ones, of course, like Owl, Ruin Kanga, of course, and, you know, Rabbit, of course, and. Yeah. Yeah, but so he's sort of like left, left under the rug very much in that one, and that's sort of, his, you know, sort of that regard, really. He wasn't even the fit in the film Christopher Robin anyway, which is quite strange, really. Um, but we have a more we have a more sentient episode about him. He gets a new dig machine, like a jackhammer spade thing, called that he calls Lucille. You know, Lucille. Also, I can't I can't pronounce it, but he, he does it like in a, in a whistle. And it's like Lucille. Also, you know, like I can't do that. And I do with this very much, but he. I don't know how the cat, the voice actor didn't even actually perfect that, but really good. It's pretty funny as well, and it's about the the others who basically try to. Um, stop him I'm very much trying to prevent him from it and he goes into like this whole like heist type mo heist um heist type episode or setup really of actually trying to steal the seal from gopher really funny actually i think it's piglet piglet who actually goes and takes himself like um is it is it when he he, he colors in bed or he leaves it on a pillar somewhere like this trophy or something it's actually really good they very interesting, of course, and also he digs himself down to in, the, in a hole, of course, using the seal and basically just stays there for. I think he just stays there for a bit until they actually rescue him or something. I think, but it's a really good one, really interesting. That's about it, really. Um, it's a fun little VHS. It's from *The Adventures of Winnie Pooh* for that Disney Channel series from the late '80s, early '90s. I think these are actually from the early, late '80s. I think '88, '89. I think could be wrong. 
or 99 one, it just depends really. I haven't managed to check, have checked the episode list on that one really, but it's a good one. It's a nice VHS to own and a bit different really, you know, because it's, Amer it's an American TV show it is. Very much, you know, animation, everything else, American voice cast, everything else, but it's really endearing of a British property because, of course, AML British he is, so fair enough. Anyway, guys, as always, thank you for watching and I'll see you for the next video, okay? And goodbye.